What's up everyone? Welcome back to my vlog or my channel, but welcome to this vlog. <laughs> I am up early on a Monday morning because I have an exciting trip, BFF trip, uh, to New York City um, from Washington, D.C. Obviously, some of you know that I live in Washington, D.C. with my best friend, uh, some of you might know him, Richie Skye. Um, he is an amazing author and influencer and personality and TV personality and star. He's amazing. Um, but, um, yeah, so I am doing that. It is around eight in the morning and, uh, we are leaving at 10, but we're meeting there at like nine, uh, 15. He has a brand deal that he's, um, with a luxury travel company that he, has decided to take me along with. And plus we already were invited to an event at the motion picture association for the motion picture association. So it's a little event that we're going to do, but we'll be there for three days and I'm going to take you guys along with me. All right. But before I take you along with me, make sure that you like and subscribe and comment. I love when you guys comment because I love reading your comments. You give me new ideas, comment ideas that you would love to see in future videos because I'm open to all of that. All right. This is a safe place to just, you know, but be kind but comment, please. All right. Um, I am going to New York, so I am wearing all black. <laughs> I have on like some cargo pants. I want to be comfortable. Um, unfortunately, I normally travel in chocolate brown and that's why my base bag is that color. Um, but I'm wearing like some black leather and black bodysuit and I have a black coat that's back there. Anyway, um, I will see you guys in a bit. just got on no one else is on with us yet maybe it'll stay that way oh actually no I'm looking it's not gonna stay that way <laughs> the seats kind of have a hydraulics thing to it it's kind of cool it's like like I'm moving around look at this it's kind of cool Yo. So, Richie and I have not been to New York together in a very long time. Five years. Five years to the day. We were here literally five years ago on the exact same three days that we are going to be here this time. So it's kind of like a reunion. I know, we're going to have so much fun. We used to come to New York. We've been to New York a few times together, right? So, yeah, it's going to be cool. More people are getting on. We have made it to NYC. We're at Hudson Yards. If you know, you know. And yeah. Fun fact, like 12 years ago, I used to come here and catch the bus over there and none of this was here. I literally have photos. If I find them, I will show you of there being literally nothing here and now it's like booming. I remember before they even broke ground. But yeah, we're here. So the experience on the jet was absolutely amazing. Um, I slept a lot <laughs> because it has these hydraulic seats so you don't feel any bumps. So that was cool. And now we're about to, I don't know what we're about to do, but we're here, so. So we have checked into the hotel. And now we are trying to find the right elevator. <laughs> and now we're trying. Now we're going to get something to eat and shop and all the fun things. And I'm trying to get better without about not cutting your head off. I'll just stand all the way back. But look how short I am. No. Oh yeah, that worked. <laughs> do that. Yeah, do that. You look a shrunken head, but yeah, do that. You guys have to see this amazing wall. It is made. Of <laughs> 
of like brush material. Look at this so it's like a hairbrush. It's like a boar bristle hairbrush in this elevator. It's funny. <laughs> We are at EJ's Luncheonette. I'm filming him, he's filming me. <laughs> I don't know what I'm gonna get, but we are starving. Yes, very New York. It's a, you ordered it and you're like, what is it? It's a lemon drop and a Bloody Mary that I hope is spicy. It's Tabasco sauce. Yeah. Thank you. Because she wants her insides to be on. I want them to burn. <laughs> Wait, can I taste it before you yeah. burn yourself? Yeah, go so ahead. Got my bloody mirror. Mmm. tastes like? I mean, crazy one. Lemonade. Spicy. I'm going to make it extra spicy. Yeah, what? Mine tastes like lemonade. Because I got a lemon drop. It's <laughs> a great photo. Different person. Because he, I'll tell you. Mmm, black and salmon sandwich. So we just passed Juilliard, and now we're at the center of Fashion Week. How do you feel about being at the center of Fashion Week? Lincoln Center. What's funny is you and I, you and I, five years ago, took a picture five right there today. in front of this, and the Lincoln Center was right in front. Do you know? We took a picture right there, and so we are at Lincoln Center on our quest to find Richie shoes. We found fashion, the home of fa all the fashion shows. And Hotel Empire, if you watch Gossip Girl, you know, you know. You don't remember that we stood up on top, up here? You remember that we stood up here and we looked and we saw the model for, um, for the vessel and all of that? This was in here. Really? Yes. I remember not. No, this is not a sponsorship for Fendi, but we are currently in Nordstrom um, looking for shoes for Terrence because he wants to wear different shoes than the ones he bought for tomorrow. I'm extremely oily. I've eaten a lot of candy. And I'm hungry again. <laughs> I'm craving sushi or noodles or something. And here he comes. What should I? What? What? You like those better? I'm saying, what do you think about this one? Is that a leather Chuck Taylor? Leatherish. I like the other one, the Nikes better. Do they not have them? No, I don't know. I'm just saying as an alternate. It's okay. These are blue. Are they? There, there's blue in the shirt. There's blue no in the pants. True. No problem. Thank you. So this will be an alternative. True. I don't hate them. So, we are trying to find food. It's only nine o'clock. It looks way later than that because it's not by out. But the there's only del where are the restaurants? They said, "Oh yeah, there's tons." Yeah, this one. Oh. There's a uh, Italian restaurant right there. Okay. Let's go see what they skip. Um, so we're on a wild goose chase, y'all. So we are at oh, that face. We're at this beautiful Thai restaurant. I want sushi, but we had Thai, and it's gonna be great. No one else is in here because we walked and walked and walked, and everything else is closed. So that's what's going on. Look at this. No other tea, right? No. Yeah. This is shrimp cracker, this is salad, this is net, this one is tamarind leaves. Oh wow! Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. You can eat with the raw food, or you can eat right now. You can taste it. Right cool. Now. Thank you so Thank much. You. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. The food has arrived. So that pineapple rice didn't have a chance in hell. 
And then Richie could hang. But mine was everything. I mean, it was both good, but it's very pineapple-y. I don't like cooked or dehydrated fruit, but this rice was insane. By the way, guys, this restaurant is called the Elephant Ear. In case you were wondering, the Elephant Ear. So, it's morning. We're all dressed. We look fabulous, I must say. Rich, look at Richie's outfit. It's so damn cute. I'm going to turn, turn to the mirror in a second show you guys. Um, it is like 7... 45 or 750 or whatever we're supposed to be there at 8 Richie decided to wake me up 30 minutes later so I had to rush glam I'm very puffy in the face and I I'm blame I'm gonna blame him all I blame it all on him I'm very the hair is big we're in a leather dress this is what we're wearing I'm wearing a leather dress that's like a shirt dress but fitted at the ass and these boots that I've had for forever and Richie is wearing tell the people what you're wearing these okay so these are um Wales Bonner, pants, really cheap. I got this from a thrift store in Japan. Turn around, let them see it. Look, see, it's got the detail here, and turn all the way around. Oh, bam, bam, bam. And then I got these Nikes last night because I wanted to be a little bit more businessy. And you look amazing. And it's kind of got a casual. sheen and a sheerness <laughs> to it, and so you can see his muscles and everything. Yeah. He looks fabulous. So far, I haven't found anything quite yet. Although that might be changing. Hold on. <laughs> um, I haven't found anything yet. Um, and apparently, neither has he. Um, but I'm always on the look for small bags because I like those, but I don't see anything cool right now. Did you not find anything over there? Or you just want me to find something for you. Did you not find anything over there, or you just want me to go find something for you? What? JW Pay? Ended up with something. Fits in that. Um, anyway. Yeah, so. I always like a small bag. But none of which that I need. Ooh, but wait a minute. Maybe. I can always use a small tan bag. Maybe not. All right, well, we are back from the consignment shop. I changed my hair, <laughs> clearly, uh, and we changed clothes, but we did a little photo shoot uh, for Richie, and now we're about to go do a little more shopping, some food. We found some more other stores that might be fantastic. Um, I just have on a turtleneck and some cargo pants that are not zipped right now, um, leather. And so, yeah, it's gonna be great. I don't know if he's changed. I think he might keep on the same thing, but um, he doesn't want to turn around and say hi to you guys. He doesn't love you like I love you, you know? 
Oh, there he is. Mm. Um, so, yeah. It's going to be fun. It's going to be great. You'll be swell. You'll be great. You can have the whole world on a plate. Anyway. So we have now left the in, hotel and we are back in... So we did not, well, let's see, went to two other vintage stores after the last place. I did not vlog in there. Um, we went to this authentic looking vintage store that was like all vintage. In fact, they weigh everything. I found a really cool coat. Um, and the girls that were working there looked really authentic with their look, <laughs> like beyond authentic. And um, yeah, so. We are now headed to cafeteria to eat because we are starvation central. And Richie found literally nothing at the stores. Mm -hmm. We got frustrated. It was hot in there, even though it's cool outside, but they got the heat on. It was just whatever. But anyway, we'll see you at cafeteria. So we're at cafeteria. Always a good staple in New York, where we know the food is going to be good. The food is always good here, and look, the lighting is even good here. <laughs> it's not? The lighting's amazing right here. Um, yeah. So, yeah, I'm starving, like I said before. Um, we are sitting actually outside, but it's covered and it's heated. It actually still feels good. But I will figure out what I'm going to get, and I'll let you guys know. We're at this place called Cafeteria. I've been here before, the food is really, really good. They got lots, they got crispy artichokes. Boom, oh, getting those. Definitely getting a cocktail. Four. Getting sure. cocktails. I want some deviled eggs. Ooh, deviled eggs. That's what they give me. That sounds good. It all sounds good. Deviled eggs. Alright, we gotta eggs? figure out what I'm gonna get. Let me focus. We're ready to order food too. Um, I'll have the cheddar and fonta, fontina mac and cheese and the hand crusted halibut. To get with our food. Alright, cheers. Thank you for inviting me on this trip. And for the fun times. Yay! And the laughter. And the laughter. Oh, it's so good. I might have to and now there's one. artichoke. Deep fried artichoke, is it? This is crispy artichoke. Crispy artichoke, which basically is deep fried. <laughs> it's not. It looks like a little rose. It's pretty, actually. A little brown rose. The food is here. Richie got Branzino. What is it? And I got halibut. Halibut. Is that what it is? And there's another artichoke on top. I'm so jealous. And we came to get snacks for the road. Waters and Asian candy that Richie got me when he went to Japan. They have it here too. Look at all the deli and all the food. Looks so good. And the cute cast. <laughs> so it's basically like 9.15 and Richie decided to drag me out because he wanted breakfast. That's where we went last night. Yeah. You want to go there again? Yeah. And it's only a block from our hotel, but I mean, I look like a hot ass mess. Ooh, what's Gotham's Market? Gotham Market is where you want to go? I said it's not there. You can go there. Okay. Well, we've been there last night, so we know what they have. Did you want to go to Gotham Market? Yeah. I really just kind of want like a breakfast thing. Well, we can run in there real quick. Neither one of us are on camera. We look like complete shit. All right, bye. So we are back where we were last night. Look at all the amazing food. Mm -hmm. And they have breakfast platters. People doing stuff. Such a cool, such a good store. 
Well, it is Wednesday morning, and we are all packed up to check out. I've got on one of the jackets that I just purchased at the shop, and Mr. Sky back there is packing. And yeah, and then we're gonna head to lunch at Queens Queen, Yard. Queens Yard. <laughs> He's told me ten times. <laughs> uh, Queens Yard, and um, yeah. Then we're gonna head back on the jet um, that we came in on. <laughs> and it's right at Hudson Yard, so we're right there. So we're going to leave it at three. So we've got a good amount of time for lunch to enjoy lunch and enjoy each other's company. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, <laughs> see you at the restaurant. You guys have seen the video all long, long. I'm actually over here. Our chair is really cool. It's absolutely gorgeous. Yeah, food, yada, yada, yada. We're starting with this bar list because I want a, a Bloody Mary of some type, of some sort, oh, of something. They have the best espresso martinis here. This is where we come to like really dive into the espresso martinis. But they also have some good shit. That is wonderful. Probably great mimosas, but I really well, want a I spicy blender. <laughs> okay, I did my part. To get a what? A espresso um, martini. Oh, no. I just feel like you're driving down my. This thing sounds right up his street. Look at this. Uh, right? This place could not be more beautiful. Like the decor is so. Oh my god. This is What? I think I've had this before, the love potion. It's vodka, hibiscus, citrus liqueur, and prosecco. So we're gonna do the pit and the peak of the drink of the trip. What's your pit and your, what's your peak? You want my pit first? Yes. Okay. My pit would be uh, I think not finding well, I have a pit but I'm not gonna share it aloud, but I will share the one I feel like I can share aloud. I think my pit would be that I didn't find like anything in the thrift stores outside of the coat that she found me. Like, I felt like we went to some pretty cool thrift shops, but like, I didn't get what I felt like I wanted, but I did get a super amazing coat, thanks to you. So that's, that's a benefit. That's the plus side of it. And my pit would be, I don't know that I have a pit. Well, probably being really sleepy at the oh, yeah. summit. That's yeah. my pit. Yeah. Yeah. Super sleepy. Um, dozed off a few times. My peak would be that I got to spend time with you and we haven't done this in so long. And it's like five years to the day that we were here and it's kind of wild. Yeah. Yeah. Um, although we've been here against, we've been here since then again. But, but um, we just haven't spent a significant amount of time together in a long time. So yeah. That was my peak. What is my peak? I mean, I think that's one of my peaks, but I don't want to take the same one. Um, I think one of my peaks is, I don't know, I think just running around the city together. You know what I'm saying? Like, it had been such a long time since we've done that. Yes. And I just feel like, even though we were tired at points, and really, really hungry, or back hurting, yes. or whatever's going on, I mean, I felt like it was great because we were together, and we just kind of know how to roll with the punches. So that's the peak for me. And my other peak would be the food. I could just eat my weight in food wherever I go. Yeah, yeah. That's always the biggest thing for me. And here, <laughs> right on time, because here comes our drinks. It's called the love potion. It's called the love potion. <laughs> Cheers. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers to an amazing trip. Cheers. Cling, cling, cling. Cling, cling, cling. Oh, that's good. It really is good. And that's I asked him if it was going to be really sweet, but it's not. It's not at all, actually. There you go. Really good. Can't wait for the food to get here, which I need to figure out what I want. So Richie ordered the shrimp cocktail. It has come. He also changed his drink. 
because he did not like the love potion. I don't mind it. It's very strong. I'm getting a little tipsy already. Um, it was very strong, but it, he, it was bitter to him. He, did, he got regular champagne because he loves champagne. He's like the champagne poppy. And he got Literally. shrimp that are about the size of his whole hand. And I ordered lobster linguine, even though I just made the linguine at home. And, but I don't care because I love pasta. It'll soak up some of this alcohol. And I might have a little Bloody Mary. I don't know. And then he ordered the, a bunch of shit. So, yeah, a burger. But like a bunch of other stuff. Right. So I finished the spritz and I decided to get a very spicy, very spicy mm, Bloody Mary. So I'm going to enjoy this Bloody Mary because I love a spicy drink. It's going to be heaven on earth. Am I tipsy or what? <laughs> I'm very tipsy. Already? You look really cute this life. You look really good. I know, send me that. You look beautiful. <laughs> so the food has arrived. Oh, whoa. It looks so good. The food good. has arrived and the spotlight is on me. Wow. That looks so good. It does look good. Alright, I'm going to try the pasta. See how it is. I think I need pepper, but we'll see. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> of course. Do you see actually pork in a place? Gotta get some noise. Yeah. Okay, yeah. mm -hmm. some more lobster. Mmm. Mmm, sauce is so good. Why am I still in my coat? I need to dig in. Like, I need to get all up in this. <laughs> It's good, but I would have been wearing it. It would have been all of your clothes? Yeah. <laughs> well, yeah. The white shirt. Because I'm white. Sumptuous. This is going to be my thumbnail. I need you to get a... Um, <laughs> I'm kidding. Thumbnail! I need you to get a shot of the back of my shirt as we're... Really <laughs> what I did get. So Richie finally got his espresso martini. <laughs> I'm so excited. He still hasn't finished that burger properly. <laughs> what the hell did you do to that burger? Finish it. Finish it! Y'all, I have been... They did not have a chance in hell. Not at all. Somebody still hasn't finished it. Eat that. Eat that meat right there. You know you want it. It was so good with all the cheese. Eat it! So Richard... <laughs> you know people call me that. Richard? I think they think my name is it's like Richard. Richard. <laughs> it's not. Richie is making me taste his... Nasty ass espresso martini. He says it's the best ever. It has gold on the top of it, as you can see. Oh my god, that's good. <laughs> so <laughs> told you. Okay, so it's not his nasty ass martinis. It's really espresso good. martinis that I've ever had at Clean Jar. Yeah. Or period. Anywhere. Period. Period. I've been coerced Olios. into an espresso martini. Shout out to my girlfriend Aria. Oh shit. Wait a Cheers. minute, you have three drinks? I'm double fisting. I convinced her to get one. It's so good. I needed something to level me out just a little bit, you know? She wanted the up or downer experience. <laughs> Isn't Richie cute? He's spoken for In this light, so I am. <laughs> In most lighting, You're I, cute I look all. like a ghoul. That's not true. <laughs> not true. You know, people used to think that, like, I pick my friends based on how they look. Because they're like, all your friends are beautiful. You know what's so funny? The, the first time I lived in D.C., um, I felt like somebody said, I remember somebody saying something like that. They're to, only friends because they're all beautiful. Yeah. Or, but wow. in my mind, I'm like, well, first off, I'm, I, I was like, well, what am I doing here? Because <laughs> I was like, I felt like uh, an alien. No. <laughs> no. But people like, really thought I get into it. They, I was a mercy. I was a mercy thing. <laughs> <laughs> a, a, a pity a pity. I was a pity pig. We're drunk. Anyway, bye. <laughs> there, there's gold. Gold leaf all on my lips from my espresso martini. Your, I didn't get none of that gold on my lips. I'm eating the gold. They're eating the dogs. They're eating the cats. 
They're eating the gold. <laughs> what is wrong with us? Now they're eating the dogs on the couch. <laughs> like, no. This is getting worse and worse. This gold leaf on my lips. So I'm like, is that lipstick or is it something else? Like, what is it? <laughs> As we were before. We are back on the jet. Back on the jet. Okay. <laughs> if you know, you know. And we are headed back to DC. Did you have a I good know. time? I had a great time. I had a blast. I want to go back home. Oh, Except really? to lay in my own bed. Yeah. The what? Except to lay in my own bed. Oh. But we did have a good meal. We did. And we, we literally just hopped on the bus. Yep. <laughs> like, really walked out of the restaurant right onto the bus. Yeah, the bus and was now leaving. Yep. And we are at tipsy. 326. Not on time. Can you imagine if we had been actually on time? Oh my god. We'd have been left. It would have been horrible. <laughs> well, that's the way the cookie crumbles. And we're leaving.